This is short review of Metotoyo Vernier calipers. I don't know if you can see, but yeah, they made in Japan. And first thing that I don't like, one year warranty. Not that I need more years, but then again, you know, when you buy a Swiss Army knife, this is way more complicated and in some cases way more cheaper than calipers and this has lifetime warranty. It is what it is. Now, second thing that I don't like this case, okay, it's, uh, it will break on you. Not the best there is. Regarding caliper itself, it's oh my god, it's 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 very well made machining, you know, smooth action. So yeah. So how to use actually uh, vernier calipers? So the, it has uh, two rulers. This one ruler, in my case, it measures in centimeters, millimeters, it can be inches. And this one is vernier ruler. So it measures decimal point of millimeter. And here you can see what kind of accuracy it has. So this model has accuracy of 0.05 millimeter. Th what that means, this one notch measures 0.5 millimeters. Now to use a vernier caliper, first you need to Make sure that your jaws uh, are clean and there is no gap. Sometimes I see people, you know, just takes uh, like paper and, and rags it so it, it cleans the jaws here. Now the another thing to note, you know, there is a surface here. So you should not measure something using the tip of the caliper. You should always uh, use specific surface for that. So when we have coin inside our jaws, it's locked. We need to see where the zero is. Okay, so the, the zero shows uh, millimeters. So zero at this point is at 22 millimeters. So yeah, you usually, <laughs> you know, you, you make uh, these calculations in your head, but just to make a point. So we already have 22 millimeters and I'm not sure that uh, what I see will be translated correctly to the camera, but you need to uh, look straight as possible to this second ruler. And I see that uh, uh, this line between uh, 2 and 3 is lined up with the main ruler. That means we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 notches. We have 5 notches and 1 notch in our case is 0 0.05 millimeters. So then that means we have here 0 0.25 okay so we add this 22 with that and we have total measurement will be 22.25 millimeters so with these jaws we can measure inner diameter of things this is my object of measurement and you can see it has these jaws. So if you have pipe, you need to insert pipe not on the tip, but fully, you know, so, so on these jaws. And you need to make sure when you measure things, you know, measure them straight, not like that, not like that, straight as possible. So, okay, so I extend my jaws and I see 18 millimeters and on vernier scale best alignment i have at eight so that means i have 18.8 millimeters not all vernier calipers has depth measurement feature so this one has okay if we extend the jaws you can see that we can measure depth. So this is beat up 
Vernier caliper made in Soviet Union jaws are not aligned properly but yeah it still works and when we extend it it doesn't have depth measurement feature so when you buy caliper if you need that you should check so how to measure depth so let's say scenario one you have uh, this kind of canal <laughs> and you need to measure depth from here to here okay so you just extend your jaws and you put your caliper like that and you can measure depth in case you have a, you you cannot rest on the middle just on one side and do a measurement like that just don't be sh make sure that your caliper is not in angle now in, ca in case like that you know so let's say we need to measure from here to, to here this this length we could use caliper like that so and we can measure do a measurement like that and if you notice at the end of the tip there is a notch this notch for cases where let's say you have rounded uh, uh, measurement surface so this could help uh, to measure more precise you know if you use that like that so you will measure more precisely yeah pretty much it uh, nice caliper very good machining smooth action yeah so case is not great you know for comparison this is Soviet Union <laughs> made in Soviet Union case so this one is robust you know and this could break just by looking at it yeah if you need caliper I recommend this model